Hello, welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. It's me, A. Prusian, and... Cold Run. And when we left off last time, there was some <laughs> red dots on our radar, right? Yeah. Somewhere Just was to that? The, to the north. How do we get there. I think we just walk there. Oh. Well, okay. <laughs> I think so. At least. There might no, be a... I, I think you're right. I was kind of looking the, the wrong way on the thing. I was like, I don't mm. see a way to get there. Okay, yeah, I'm seeing these shadow curse guys over here now. Yeah, let's pick mm. a fight. I picked a fight. Okay. <laughs> I thought that maybe I could get closer before that happened, but no. Okay, it's fine. Oh, the the uh, I see that revealed, so it looks like they're going to have invisibility shenanigans afoot. Yeah. Well, luckily, we know somebody who can see some of that. There's yeah. my frenzy. It's been a while since I played Carlac. I was like, where's her rage button? <laughs> there it is. All right. I missed her. I know. It's been so long. Is she still using that weapon from, like, the first demon we fought yeah yeah she is <laughs> it fits her well right uh reckless attack there we go Holy crap. yeah <laughs> it's dead <laughs> okay so is there anybody else she can see to hit maybe i'll do a ranged attack on somebody Nice. Okay. Not bad. Aura, Aura of Vile of... Oblivion. Life drain. All, near... All nearby light sources get extinguished when the wraith is nearby. So that's not a worry, though, for us. Yeah, really. because we are... Uh... We helped the fairy ones. We did, yeah. Okay, look the far realm. Oh there God. we go. That worked pretty well. I'll take it. There, find him, quote. <laughs> Cutting hurts. Oh, they still hit. The boring opponent. <laughs> <laughs> How many of those cutting words do they have? There's got to be like, sorry, if, if you had to guess over under a hundred. I mean, God, it's in, it's incredible to think it could be over, but like at this point in the game, I wouldn't be shocked, you know? Yeah. I'm going to spirit guardian up is what I'm going to do. I can only assume these guys don't like radiant stuff. Oh, and they're vulnerable to Lathander's light, too. Mm. That's fantastic. I almost feel bad we're bullying the shadows over here. Yeah. But you know. They we're probably doing bad stuff. Though. Right. We got bullied by Githyanki the other day, so it's fine. <laughs> Wait, isn't that like a cycle you're supposed to break? Like in one generation? <laughs> like if he uses you and you, you're just supposed to not do that to others. Mm -hmm. Well. <laughs> Alright, the wraith is down. Uh, I thought. Oh, there's a shadow here. I see. Alright, well, you're about to regret it. life choices of being a shadow next to Karlak. <laughs> she still has more attacks. She just has to find a target. There we go. Hey! Well, we got XP, but there's still shadows. Okay. So we must have killed somebody, but... Oh, there's two right next to me. Yeah. There's like three right next to one of them going. just died. Perfect. Okay, I'm gonna just do a friendly little fireball here. Perfect. Got to concentrate. Um. Okay. Sh 
Shadow Heart jumped, and now to move next to these guys, yeah. And now hit him. The old standing there menacingly attack that she does. Right? I like this divine strike thing she can add. So she can add, like, poison to her hit. Mm. Which is pretty cool. I think she can also add... Does it have to be? I'm not sure if it has to be poison or if it could also be radiance. But anyways, moot point. Nice. Need to find a way forward. Okay. Yeah, is this just part of it? Part of the house of healing? That we just didn't come all this way the first time around. I guess. Though there's. Though are you seeing what's down the stairs there? No, I'm not, because I'm looting stuff. Mm. But. Yeah. So this is. Let me just check out the house of healing stuff first. So this is a door. Could have gone out and didn't. Okay. Oh, yeah. Side door of the House of Healing. Okay, but then you said there was down some stairs? Oh. Oh, shit. What is this? Oh, the morgue. Right. We're shadow cursed in here. Oh, I'm heading in. The fuck? We shouldn't be shadow cursed. We have blessings of Salune. Okay, um. Maybe if I equip a torch? Did that help me? Doesn't seem like it. Yeah. Without a light source, this is one turn remaining on the Shadow Curse. Without a light source, you will take necrotic damage every turn. The damage doubles each turn you are affected by the Shadow Curse. Okay, mm -hmm. let me end the turn and see. She's gonna have a torch. To... The curse is too strong. Oh, the curse is too strong for torches. Okay. But well, we shouldn't need torches at all. I know. That's why I'm confused. And I'm beginning to realize that I might not have saved. Um... Oh, should we leave and save and come back? Not enough movement. Yeah, let me exit from base and leave. Get out! Whoa! What? Did you hear that? No. Drums? I, that was weird. Whoa! As I as we as I left the, it, I heard a sound of like a moaning during the loading screen. Oh yeah. Moaning and a dog getting hurt. Ugh. Like whining. Weird. Okay, so we have our Blessing of Salune. Oh, wait, this is... We're missing our deeper blessing. Okay, I know what to do. I know what to do. Okay. Karlak, you're up. You have... A jingly bell. Use. Bring, bring! Ooter scooter! You look like you want to say the magic words. Like they're right on the tip of your lips. I think um, that we lost our pixie blessing somehow. So I'm trying to get it back. Mm. My lovely Dolly Thrice, who is so very sweet and nice, won't you assist your humble friend so I won't meet my cursed end? <laughs> I sure love it when they beg. Yeah, just be careful. That blood she's covered with is not her own. But there we go. Now I think we're good. When do you say, when do you think we lost it? Um. Well, Hastan told me at one point that it was like a bug where if you leave the Shadow Curse lands and come back, sometimes you lose the status. Mm. So it's possible we lost it a while ago and didn't notice until now. Um, how do I... There we go. Okay, so I don't need the torch, although... I guess it's not bad to have some more light. No. Um, speaking of, I'll just light these braziers. Oh, yeah. Wait, do they just immediately unlight? What a terror. Oh, because of the curse. Duh. Yeah. Okay. Wait, no, don't. Ah! Sorry, I was trying to press forward, and instead it thought I was pressing the door, which was behind me. Sometimes. Yeah, I'm kidding. This game. <laughs> it doesn't go well with me. 
Uh, stained towel, blood, mm, lovely. This place seems great. What are you looking at? I'm looking at this notice that's, uh, that's up here by the, to the right of the owl bear. All right, let's see. A reminder, sisters. Do not forget that patients passing through these hallowed halls must needs be stripped of such frivolous items as jewelry, timepieces, and extraneous gold amounts. These burdens can be safely stored in the vault behind the hidden wall, that they are not that they not confuse matters between ourselves and Kethrick's justiciars. We'd like to avoid misunderstandings, if possible. Indeed. So how do we get into that vault? Wait, what do does that think? mean? What it, does it mean that they that that we have to r remove or at least that they were looking to remove frivolous items, you know, jewelry and all that, to not confuse matters? What does that mean? I think they're hiding it in the vault to not confuse matters. They don't want the Dark Justiciers to know that they're stealing all that stuff. That's my guess. Oh, oh, gotcha. Okay. That is my guess. Here's a button. I'm going to yeah, press the button. Open the secret door. Open the not-so-secret door. Well, it was, it was secret because you... I didn't see the button. You perceived it. You oh, passed the per perception okay. check and saw it. Got it. Charred corpse. That said, the button wasn't... I don't know if the button was hidden or something, or if we just didn't notice the giant button. Right. Um, I think I... Have I actually encumbered myself already? I just unloaded. So, oh, I picked up a whole bunch of shit. Oh, right, 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 right. So bad at not picking up all the shit. I'm gonna have to the next time I play this game. I'm gonna have to play a strength-based character, so that I can pick up all the shit, and it won't matter. Mm. Uh, okay, that's better. I'm out of the danger zone. Okay. Well, so far there's nothing that interesting. Here. Oh, I guess there's a giant wooden chest. Let's see what is in here. Strange tendril amulet. It gives you the Evard's Black Tentacle spell. Three to eighteen that damage. Tentacles sprout from the ground, turning the area into difficult terrain, attacking and smothering creatures within. It mm. sounds cool. Is that really it, though? Steal some boots. Okay. Hmm. This doesn't seem to be the vault. That doesn't seem to be the stash, right? That's not like a real stash. I am unimpressed with their stash, at least. Hmm. Could there be another secret button somewhere? I'm gonna look on the other side, too. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't really make sense, because we found the button near the notice, so that seems to be the thing, but, like... Yeah. Huh. Okay. Well, whatever. Let's go into the morgue proper. Maybe the Dark Justiciers did find their vault. And already or maybe the it. jewels they consider were not all that much in right. our con in our by our standards. It's possible. Oh shit! Zombies. Oh, where? See this one? Uh, just to see where my owl bear is looking. Yeah. Right over the grate there. Huh. Oh, it is it's labeled not... zombie, isn't it? Yeah. Huh. Well. Undead Fortitude. When reduced to zero hit points, regain one hit point instead unless the damage was radiant or caused by a critical hit. Hmm. Well, we have a solution to that. They're going to jump scare us shortly, right? We're going to oh. move in and then they're all going to get jumped. Yeah. Up. Okay. 100%. I'm curious if I can... Oh. Okay, well, uh, I thought maybe I could pre-kill the zombie. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, we have been poisoned. I wondered about that, too. There's kind of a green miasma around, right? So. Oh, it's under the trap, the vent. The vent, it was, it was covering a vent. Oh, I must have hit the vent when I thought I was hitting the zombie. 
Okay. Or maybe you hit it, it woke up, and it unblocked the vent because it got up. Possible, too. In any case, I apologize then about the, uh... All of the... Yeah, the... the... Can't afford to let up. Why can't she call her spirit guardians? Can't do anything with Shadowheart. That sucks. Well, so much for peace. Okay. Oh, there's vents everywhere. Uh, shoot. Um, okay. So in hindsight, we probably maybe we should have disarmed the vents. I guess. Eh, yeah. Before fighting, but I think it'll be okay. Bye forever, pal. Okay. I don't think she still has her frenzy. So. Poor fucker. <laughs> Poor fucker indeed. <laughs> Can I get to this guy? Looks like I can. I have disadvantage on him. Reckless attack. Okay. Need to stay focused. Yeah. So they can so... only be killed really by uh by radiant or yeah the problem is okay i'm getting her out of the poison cloud well she's using her her torch still i think right that... oh that's the problem shit you're right how do i equip her thing instead i'm clicking the toggle weapon button and nothing's happening does that take an action unless is the to is the torch thing just a maybe i maybe i'm wrong maybe the torch thing is just visual no, um, no, because she doesn't have access to her spells. Oh, this she, sucks. I think it looks like her melee is marked as a torch. So it looks like yeah. both her melee and her right. her lighting are both torches. So did she unequip her... Uh... No, I think it just... I toggled the source and then... Or maybe, I don't know. But it fucked it up. Okay. I think I need, have to have an action. I think she doesn't have an action and she needs one. Oh, okay. Which was okay. what I was afraid the issue was, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't like this toggle light source thing. I'm not, maybe because I haven't done it enough, but I'm like, it confuses me and I don't know what I'm doing with it. Mm. And so, I like, I didn't, why would you think that the torch would replace the melee, you know? Yeah. Like, it should just switch to the torch, not take your melee weapon off. So now she still can't do an action, and like this is the perfect place for her to do her spirit guardian. So I'm really frustrated because it's just Nothing the freaking torch. <sighs> That's preventing it. Okay. Do we want? Do you want to reload? Like before? Before this? No, it's okay because I think we're gonna win. I just I'm annoyed. But. I think Carlite can get this guy that has two hit points down. Uh, we'll make sure we get that guy. Okay. So good. It's so good. <laughs> okay. This is my happy place. Because at least even if um I'm having trouble getting Shadowheart. At least uh, Karlak is doing great over here. Yeah. So. She's not unlikely to get a critical hit, like, to finish it off. Right? Oh, she's got to hit him again, huh? Okay. Cause they, oh, yeah. Did that, did that crit them? That must have. Or they might only be able to re to get the one one per turn. I don't know. Oh, like, good point. Like, if it's a Maybe reaction. It... I... Maybe. Yeah, we'll see if Undead Fortitude goes away after there. No, that one got up. But, you know. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see if after we kill, you know, quote unquote, kill one, we'll see if Undead Fortitude goes away. Yeah. Fox is none. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna do Shadowheart and we're gonna do the thing. We're gonna do. Radiant. Yeah. 
Here we go. That's right. And now she will heal Carlac a little bit. Take two. Oh. Time to push my luck again. Okay. okay I'm gonna hit this guy who has one. Oh, that was a crit. Oh, perfect. And and so I brought it down to zero, and then it got back up, and it did lose the fortitude zero. Okay, okay. So don't, they only get that once. Which is good, because otherwise, like, you wouldn't be able to do this without a lucky crit or without radiant damage, which doesn't right. sound fun. Missed. That's not what I wanted. I wanted a frenzy. She hits so damn hard. Oh, it's incredible. Okay, what you gonna do? Hey, there we go. The spirit guardians. They did their job. Can't give up. Alright. Let's uh Yeah. Okay, we're still a little bit covered in poison it is yeah we are so maybe so let's not linger agreed i'm gonna see if the greater zombie at least has something good on candles and some gold there's, Terrible. there's a lever here yes hit the lever push hit it the to lever. try it yes hopefully oh can't use it right now i'm a bear I don't oh know how shit okay Today, i'm coming one day i'll catch uh, a break Okay, it's let's like see. Where's the lever? I see it. Stuck from this side. Oh, uh, it's stuck for all of us. Shit. You can come up if you can come up uh, to where I am. There's no poison cloud anymore. Okay. Up, up, up above here, at least. Yeah. And we are kind of saving from it a little bit sometimes. Um. Hmm. Okay. Morgue lab door. I'll try to lockpick this. Yeah. Don't give me trouble now. Or maybe Carlac should, because she's the replacement to Starion right now. Oh, difficulty 18. Well, we'll see how this goes. <laughs> don't know. That's going to be close. <gasps> Guidance was just enough. Oh, you got it? Nice. Got it. Unlocked. Okay. This had to be that one guy that we talked into killing himself, right? In the House of Healing. This has to be his lab. Oh, uh oh. I had a perception fail. You did. Yeah, so it was somewhere on the. Hmm. Perception successful. A lever. A lever. Well, nice job. What, what what did that do? Boy, that opened up quite a lot. <laughs> I'm sure it actually did. I just don't know what yet. Right. A lot of good stuff here. Mm. Or a lot of interesting stuff anyway. Right? Ooh, there's a potion of uh greater hmm. healing here. I'll take, I'll that. take that. Perception failed. There is be wary. Ah. This place is trapped. Okay, I'm gonna try to disarm. I am no Astarian, but at least I have some bonuses. Ooh, I think I got it. Nice. You can play Astarian on TV. That's right. <laughs> oh, now I have to lockpick it. <laughs> No rest for the weary. I guess I could always try opening these things. Like, I always default to, it's locked. We lock pick it. But sometimes we have keys, and we just never know. Oops. Yeah. Okay. I guess it's just time. what I was saying about the, the radiant thing, about how it's good that, like, you don't need radiant to be the zombies. Like, I mm -hmm. think they're making it so you don't necessarily need a Ooh. rogue at all times of the party to progress. And I like that design right. choice. I uh, can't believe it. I rolled a 2 and tallied up to 13, but it was a 14. 
So I'm going to use the thieves tools to try again. Let's see if I can get it this time. Okay, I rolled a five. That's enough. Oof. Opulent chest. Okay, has Eversight ring. Blind immunity. The wearer cannot be blinded. And a bunch of gold. Okay, sure. Um, why not? Excuse me. Anything so else seems that seems interesting oh, yeah. here? Yes, very much. Well, there's I see like a blood bank log, a tissue and organ register, surgeon's research notes. Okay. And oh, Carabasin's poison. poison. What is this? Yeah, you look at that. Uh, coat your weapon with uh, act with, with poison. Target must succeed a Constitution saving throw or become paralyzed and poisoned. Wow, that sounds incredibly strong. Yeah. I'm throwing this over to. I guess Carlac. She seems to be the most likely to hit with hit stuff with weapons. Yeah. She does like doing that. All right, here's <laughs> she the... does. That's her pastime. <laughs> here's our tissue and organ register. Donor, unidentified gnome, recovered, bladder, left lung, cause of death, unknown necrosis. Hmm. Notes, gangrenous skin, distal extremities missing. Oh, that sounds terrible. Unidentified dwarf recovered left hand, both feet, brain, left hemisphere, cause of death, abdominal, abdominal hole, arcane origin. Notes: run through by lightning, brain's right hemisphere scorched. Ugh. Uh, it, it does hit me that like a coroner's job in the D and D universe has got to be wild, <laughs> right? Like the list of possible things. Yeah. The list goes on. The final entry. Includes an extensive note inked in a flowing script. Catherick promised the finest specimens, yet Balthazar provides naught but dregs for my research. A spleen here, a finger there, an intact head if I'm lucky. That bloody necromancer's kept the finest cadavers for himself. I will talk to my nephew. Whether he listens is another matter. They're fighting over corpses. Talk to my nephew. Maybe uh, this is, must be like... Catherick's uncle or something? Yeah, I, I think that's the, the guy, the surgeon that we talked into killing himself. Oh, I think yes, he was yes, a yes. thorn. So. so here's another one. Um, surgeon's notes, I think. I discovered all too late that I was making things much harder on myself than necessary. There was no need for such complex chemical experimentation. No, foolish me. I ought to have tuned to that which had already been perfected by nature. Fortunately, my research led me to the carapace of the carrion crawler, which contained a paralytic agent so powerful, I must be quite cautious not to breathe it in during the refinement process, lest I fall asleep at my workbench. Huh. Hmm. Research notes. Interesting. You know, I just I picked up this blood bank bottle lying mm -hmm. on the ground. My first thought was, like, almost a Dragon Age thought. Like, I'll bet we could use this as a gift to romance historian. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm just looking at a blood bank log here, which is just the a log of the different yeah half elf they killed and human that they extracted their blood, lymph, and spinal fluid. I, I just like uh, one of the addendums here is you will use addendum. Uh, you will use either the term donor or vessel when describing a source of extraction. Victim is an ugly and inaccurate word. <laughs> oh God. Good to be alive. And they even describe one of the one of the items to, uh, recovered. From one of the what do we from one of the donors, is uh, a corpse confiscated by Balthazar. So it looks like Balthazar and this guy were working together. Yeah, which makes sense. Okay, I'm gonna send Carlac into the muck and see if she can push that lever now that we push the other lever. Oh, of course, that's what it does. That's my guess. I don't know if it really will. A, it did. I was right. Oh my god. You know what might also have worked? What? Is the, the grease. Didn't we learn, like, the other day that, like, oh, grease yeah. can sometimes help with that sort of... But maybe this was a different kind of stuff. Read order. There we go. No. Read. Okay. All right. <laughs> Reordered. Okay. On my mind. And so well, let's go maybe. this way. Shadowheart, you and I, we're gonna make it through this poison, I 
promise. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. We all took minimal damage. It's fine. Okay. So what in the world have we found here? <laughs> this is not what I was expecting. It's very Hellmouth uh, in Destiny on the uh, Moon. Yeah, you, you go up to the edge. Yeah. Um... Huh. Oh, there are like, there's a floor, there's bodies down there. Oh, It's not wow. bottomless, which was my original thought. We can climb. Oh, God. Okay, well, let's we can try we can it. Also, we can jump. So there's a, other stuff across, around here. Mm -hmm. There's... I gave myself better jump. Oh, there's a whole other, whole other uh, path Wonder here. Possible. Beyond here. Yeah, I'm going to try to unlock this chest because it's here. Okay. And I can? Question mark? Oh, I think I can! Maybe you're I guess Bard is really not that far off from... I mean, it's not like a lockpicking master, but it's right? like an apprentice, right? It's like, okay, lockpicking. Yeah, caustic reprisal. Whenever a creature deals melee damage to the wearer, that creature takes one to four acid damage. Flesh melter cloak. That's pretty cool. Flesh melter cloak. I actually Wait. might put that on Carlac, although it's going to be say, ugly is... as fuck. <gasps> oh, poor Carlac. She's here for stats, not fashion. Uh, apparently. I mean, eh, everything looks kind of gross green right now, so it's hard to tell. These things have stayed interesting. But things do the way, melee damage her. Hmm? Have you taken a look at the item description on Shadowheart's underwear? No. Why would I I'd love to, have thanks. done that? God. Oops, uh, Shadowheart. Let's see. If pants could brood... <laughs> <laughs> okay, now wait, what does Carlac say? How do these not burn off? <laughs> what a Next good time we game. get to camp, we gotta look at everyone's underwear. Right. Oh man, what a good game. Alright. All right. What now? Uh are you gonna jump over there or should I? Oh uh Yeah. Whee. Uh, too far, even with my big, my good jump. Did I? My, maybe my good jump went away. And if this doesn't oh, work, I can also do fly. Oh no, my my good jump had gone away. <laughs> okay. Shadowheart's like, I am not strong enough for this. I'm staying over here. Mm. Touche. We'll come get her if we need her. Okay. Well. So there's two paths here. Do you want to yeah. go down to the pit from here or up uh, to the up and see what's beyond? Uh, huh. Let's do the pit first. It's here. All right. But I'm going to save Saving just in case smart. <laughs> we have trouble getting back up for some reason. Should we bring a healer to this? It feels like I don't know. I worry we may trigger. Well, Do you think we'll trigger a fight down here or no? Um. If we do, we'll come back with Shadowheart if we need to. Okay. But it's gonna be. Oh. Yep. Fetid Uzi. Oh boy. And hollow armor. Yeah. Okay. Uh. How bad are these guys? They, they might be kind of bad. Okay, yeah, I'll definitely... Okay, I'm just gonna reload. Um, and we'll grab Shadowheart and then push forward to go down there. Whee! <laughs> these enhanced jumps are pretty fun, actually. I appreciate that this is just a cantrip and I can just cast it on her and me and not like use up a million spell slots. 
Yeah. It was one of the smarter choices I've made in leveling, I think, because we're just not strong characters, and so there have been lots of times where it's like, oh, we want to jump and we can't. Not all of us are owl bears, so. No. It's I'm I think just I think it's so much fun that owl bears can just leap across entire chasms and just Right. It's pretty impressive. Oh, don't move forward. I'm I waiting. Accidentally jumped forward. Oh, okay. More, You're fine. Or forward. I thought I was gonna land on you for a second. Oh. I okay. <laughs> thought you were worried about starting the fight. Oh no. Uh which speaking of I might have Carla go down first. Okay, I'm gonna save here. Yeah. Got it. And I'm gonna send Carlac forward because she'll want to be in melee, you know. So I want yeah. her there when it starts. The rest of us can get down. Yes. Fetid aura. All nearby creatures fall victim to the ooze's fetid fumes and take one to six acid damage per turn. Ooh. Oh, just gotta kill stuff quick, I guess. Yeah. I'm just throwing daggers. I have so many daggers. I gotta, like, get rid of some of these daggers. <laughs> Which I guess I could have had her do from up above. But... Do we all have the aura? No, just, uh, just Karlak in the drink. Okay. <laughs> Oh, right, because the flesh melter cloak does nothing against the things made of flesh metal thing. Right, that makes a lot of sense. Um, but, nonetheless, she is going to ruin some days. Let's see. Actually. They have resistance to slashing and lightning. Casting spells is blocked down here. Don't jump down. Hmm. This attack. Not too bad, Carlax. Finish this. Okay. Yeah, it's high defense, so I'm gonna go for it. Okay, that worked pretty well. And then let's heal Carlax a bit. We need everyone. Oh, saved against the strength drain. I was like, what are you doing to Carla? <laughs> the belly flop. <laughs> Wait, what just happened? I don't know, but you belly flopped in. Did they pull you down? They must have. The. Let me see. I'm looking, I'm scrolling back up because there was a lot of stuff that happened. Hollow Armor used Shadow Torrent. The Shadow Torrent, I think, made me slip, and I did a bunch of bludgeoning damage to everyone because I belly flopped on their heads. <laughs> Which is pretty great. That's amazing. I was trying wanting to do that anyway, and they, that was... Thank you. <laughs> oh, amazing. And I gave some health points. A few. That's incredible. Now it's a shadow. The shadow came out of the armor. The hollow armor. Ah. You killed the armor and the shadow came out. That is cool. It said it was shadow animated, but I thought that just meant that it was like brought back by magic. I didn't. It, right? It's actually literally shadow animated by a shadow. Okay. That is so cool. strike action here. That's right. Okay. Uh, actually then... Let's 
for another dagger. Got it. Her melee only had a 65% chance of hitting, but throwing... Uh, she has so many daggers and shit. Like, this is kind of nice just to help clear some out. And it had like a 90% chance, so I was like, you know what? We'll just do that then. Yeah. She does d decent damage with it. Don't do it. Don't. Whew. Okay. Nice. Yeah, I'm not doing much because of the whole slashing resistance. So. Yeah. But That's... they're almost they're almost dead. Yeah. Never a dull moment. Okay, just the shadow left, I think, so... Yeah, all three hit points. Well... There he goes. Nice. Down and dusted. Okay. This uh, armor has protective plate, which gives uh, resistance to necrotic damage. Oh! Nice. I'm gonna let you loot stuff because you're already down there. I'm gonna be sure. honest. <laughs> oh my god, all my daggers are down there. I think you can They're just all pick there. them up. You can pick them all up again. That's mm. actually amazing. I was not expecting that. Yeah, me neither. Just give them back to Carlac. Jeez. Yeah. So is there anything, anything else, else here? here? Yeah, besides the... I'm not seeing anything pop up. I guess it's just a fight? Well, that's okay. It was a I fun maybe little fight. The, maybe the reward is that ar uh, armor that was on the uh, hollow. Yeah. And the anti-necrotic damage. Yeah, and I bet you're right. Be good at times. <laughs> right? Okay, so let's go see what was out that other path. I think it might just be an exit, but worth seeing. Yeah. Seeing where it exits at. Where are we going? Yeah. Ominous Crevice is the name of our exit here. I'll wait for you to catch up. Okay. I'm gonna do a short rest. Uh, yeah. Anything? Before I go into something called an ominous crevice. Uh, and I will un owl bear. Okay. There's a backpack by the door here. Anyone oh. thinking it? No, nothing. I missed it. I, I already clicked the thing. Uh, where are we? Oh, on the other side of the House of Healing in the Grand Mausoleum entrance. Huh. Oh, interesting. I guess we could have probably come here before. This has just been another another way. Yeah. Where was the morgue? It was... Oh, yeah, we came underneath some stuff. There's a house here. Interesting. Sure. Take a look. Rope netting? Oh, perception failed. Uh oh. Cursed Kuotea lost condition invisible because Errol can fucking see them. Oh, this is, look at this, is a fish zombie. How very bloodborne of them. Very. Right? Vulnerable to lightning and cold. And we're fighting them. <laughs> okay. Oh, gosh. There's a, oh, there's a whole bunch of them aren't there. Yep, yep. Okay. All right. We'll do that. Um... Oh, my God. Look at the, uh, how many there are. 
Yeah, it's it's a lot. I suspect they're gonna go down fairly easy though, or at least I hope. Um Easy. Bop. Do we have any ice ice or lightning stuff we can do to them? Yeah. Like scrolls or I don't know anything. They're bunched up at least. Okay, well I did, yeah, I did a little bit with Karlak there. Are they oh. netting you? Oh, they are. Hmm, don't like that. Well, they're trying to net you. You've got your ice methods out. I do. I'm also, so I'm just gonna scroll through. I won't give in. Only cold. I'm gonna try to cone of cold them. I, I know I often regret using scrolls instead of just owl bearing, but this do it. This is, seems like a great time, anyway. though. Trim. Cutting room. Oh! Stop, stop. <laughs> oh! Okay. <laughs> Hell yeah! <laughs> Don't worry, that was worth it. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay. Nice job. And there's the chief. Unfortunately, in melee range of me, which I do not love. Um, uh, hmm. You know what? I think you're, it's a great idea you had. I'm going to just see if sacrificing one of my ice methods will be worth it. Okay. Uh, all right, let's have let's death first on y'all. Yeah. Is that a bonus action? No, it's a regular action. Okay. Pop. Oh, yep, that worked. Oh yeah. Yeah, it killed like oh my a god, a bunch of them. It sure did. I look over and there's like no guys left. <laughs> nice. Okay, this guy wants to stand in melee with me. He can stand in a cloud of daggers. Need to act fast. On move. Oh, okay, I can't actually. Fine, we'll just do this. There's the guy inside. Yeah, these guys are coming out. It's good, because I want to bring Karlak down to attack them. I see the remains of your ice method destruction. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> Carlic, as fun as it is to have you on the roof, we're gonna come up and melee this guy so that he regrets his life choices. Yeah, just like that. Can I get to. Oh, I can actually. Say bye bye. <laughs> Okay. Did you make new ice melfit methods? I did. I, I'm probably I love not gonna it. sacrifice them, but yeah, bring them back. Oh, that's great. Oh, he took an opportunity attack. Oh, but he's out of the cloud of daggers. That's fine. Um, I would prefer not to be in such close quarters. But I'm a little bit stuck. Let's see what else I can do. Anything interesting? Oh, fuck it. When in doubt. Ignis! When in doubt, Ignis. Okay. Yeah. Roast the fish. <laughs> yeah. It sounds delicious, right? Moving. It does. I 
don't know that she can get to anybody. There we go. Good job, Shadowheart. I wonder what happens if they net you. They did. Oh, they did? Are you stuck? I am immobile. Uh-huh. I mean, I could still hit their... hit this thing, but... If I can target it, it's like inside the... Ha oh, there we are. Yeah, it's really weird, right? Nice. Yeah, good throw. <laughs> and I turned off the cloud of daggers right before Carlac could run through it. <laughs> mm. Oh, they have pearls. And there are treasures here, and there's a chest inside here with, like, some shells and okay. a starfish. Okay, let me see what the chief has. He's got a lightning jabber. It's a spear. On a hit, possibly shock your target. When launched at a target, deal an additional one to four lightning damage. Catch you later, Ellis. Oh my god. I'm gonna give that spear to Carlax so she can throw it at um, people. The good reason to. Yeah, I like it. Right? So, cool. Who knew all this was going to be here? I just, give up now. this is, I love like stuff like this game and Elden Ring where you just like, you think you've seen everything and then there's something else. It's amazing. Yeah. I, love it. I don't know that there's, is there anything else in this? I have to keep going. In or around this house? I guess it's just the, just a little fishy ambush. Yeah, it seems to be. Campfire. Fish. And steal their dinner. Well, there's a painted Maybe chest over here. It's in the painted chest. A couple of arrows. Roaring thunder and arrow of monstrosity slaying. Oh, those are fun. <laughs> Yeah. Oh god, I'm picking up all these crossbows. I'm gonna be encumbered in like two seconds. But guess what I'm about to do? Yep, pick up another crossbow. You're right. <laughs> but that, but you're. I mean, it. I shouldn't encumber you because you're right clicking and sending them immediately to Lazel, right? <laughs> oh right, right. Yeah. Well, I will be in a moment. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of, I think that's probably a pretty good spot to end at today. Um, and next time, I swear to God, we will go to Moonrise Towers. At least to free yeah. some people. We'll see what happens after that. Uh, but yeah, thank you all for watching. We'll catch you the next time. Bye. Bye-bye.